Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> so I know it's been a while since I uploaded a video, and um, that's because I took a mental health break. Um, I really wasn't in the right set of mind um, to be making videos with everything going on. Um, so, as you guys know, I don't know if I told you guys this, but I had to have a DNC, um, and they inserted a UID, um, I recently had a checkup, they had to insert a new UID because the other one had broke, um, and then they did a biopsy, and I, they called me yesterday for the results saying that they want to do another DNC, um, just to make sure that everything's going okay and running smoothly. Um, so I got some sad news, uh, probably about... Four months ago, um, I had to put Meatball to sleep. Um, he just, you know, for those of you who don't know, Meatball's my cat. Um, well, was my cat. Um, he couldn't get around. He had arthritis really bad. He was having accidents, couldn't get into the litter box. Um, it took him a while to migrate around the house. Um, he was in so much pain, and this is how much pain he was in to move. Um, Meatball did not like kids or people when they came to visit, he would run. But, um, when my cousin had his daughter over like he did not move at all he let her touch him and everything and that's when I knew that he it hurt him to get around so I had to do what was best for him and that was sadly to put him to sleep um So there's that. <laughs> um, I'm still looking for a place to live. I'm on the waiting list. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to get my own place or if I'm going to move in with my mom to help her out. Um, that's kind of... <laughs> I'm leaning towards my own place because I, I don't know, like... I get moody sometimes because of my bipolar. Um, and I just like to be by myself. Like, I've been in a funk. Um, and, you know, thank goodness for my aunt because she's been doing the cat. Like, I know I technically don't have a cat. But I would like to help her out, you know. And something that I used to do was, like, I used to get up and do the cat litter. And then on garbage days, I would, like, collect garbage before anybody else was up, you know. And I kind of got out of that habit, and I'm not sure why. And it's just, like, I'm in a funk, and I feel blah, and... They've been messing with my medication for my bipolar. Like, okay, um, I'm, I suffer from bipolar depression. And, like, when I get low, I get, like, really low. Like, there's, like, it takes months to come out of it. And, uh, I'm trying to work on that. But it's, like, so hard. <laughs> Especially when I'm depressed, you know, I don't get like the manic part of bipolar. I'm like the depressed part of bipolar. And, um, I don't know. 
Then I had to get a new therapist, and now she's on medical leave, so I see her on the 4th, which is doing a video of it. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> I haven't really been cooking. Like, my aunt's been doing all the cooking. Um... I want to try to get into cooking to do more videos and to give her a break, you know, because sometimes you get burnt out when you're doing it all the time. Um, that and she mainly takes care of my grandma and that. My grandma's getting worse. She's not remembering and she's moody. Um, for those of you who don't know, my grandma has dementia. Um, basically that is all. <laughs> so, um, I just wanted to come on and give you guys an update. I'm still alive. Um, so I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.